Hey guys, I have a huge surprise for you guys this week. I painted my room to match my bird. Let's go see it. All right guys, it's an interesting day today. Capri's room's being painted. So we have blue outside on our screened in back porch area. We're keeping her in our cage for now. I'm gonna go ahead and show you how we clean this cage. I know we've showed it before, but it's a really simple, easy process. So I'm gonna walk you through it again because it needs to be done. And yeah, this is a great way for Blue to get lots of extra sunlight and fresh air by just putting her cage outside. And it's so nice out that it works. Also, since the last time you guys probably saw Blue, she was getting all nesty in her toys. We separated the toys and we don't have any more nestiness, which is really exciting. You can see she's just in the open areas. All right, so since Blue is safely out here and it looks like most of Capri's room is as well, I'm gonna go take a look at what Capri's room looks like so we get a before and after. Wow, kiddo, your room looks spacious and echoey. <laughs> All right, we should probably get all this stuff down so that he can paint more easily. Stars. Say goodbye to your room color, Capri. It's gonna be different. This is what we're going for. Should look like blue. It's tame teal. Tame teal. Did you notice anything about her cage? That it's outside and that the bottom is clean. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I really want to take her. Okay. you're in the sun. Does that feel better? Little Blue, you look really nice in the sun. That crazy wing. Ah, Capri's room is supposedly done. So it's kind of a nice ambiance out here. Blue has been outside all day in this screened in area. And right now it is raining. You can see the drops on the ground, but it's sunny out. It's one of those perfect, beautiful, thunderstormy evenings. 
And this is normally Blue's bedtime. It's 6.30 in the evening, but it's so pretty. I can't put her to bed because it's just so nice outside for her to still be out here. Right, Blue? Listening to the thunder, listening to the rain. It's warm. You can actually see it. I love when it's raining and it's sunny. I just think it's awesome. So we're gonna enjoy this. The Elna Cage comes with these dial perches. Dial perches aren't good for constant long-term use, unless covered with something, like jute twine, which is a natural rope. This makes it much nicer on their feet. You can also use vet wrap, which is soft and grippy. Another option is to use more natural wood perches in the cage. One of Blue's favorites is our party perch which combines a perch and a toy in one. It's really important that your birds don't breathe in the paint smell because it's toxic to them. To make sure Blue's safe, I have my door closed, my windows open, and the fan on. It's Blue's bedtime, so we're gonna bring her in and put her to bed.